selection, move it around, make him work. So Draymond Green, his second game back in the Audi starting lineup with Steph Moses Moody for Clay. Wiggins, Draymond, and Looney, and Steph Curry opens the scoring. So they start with Herb Jones on Steph, and he's just kind of shading him back towards the basket. Doesn't want him to get the three. He was about to come off the screen, got back door. This season in pretty good shape. Curtis Blair and Jason Goble, Danica Mosher will blow the whistles tonight. Draymond with Zion on him. Shot clock at five. Wiggins with a shot clock at one. And just tenths of a second after the buzzer. They'll use Valanciunas that way. He's a really good passer, great handoff guy. Valanciunas another three, and this one good. And they're giving that up. You saw two defenders stay with Zion. I mean, for New Orleans to open two of three on threes, and then the deflection. Herb Jones on the push ahead and basket is ridiculous. He's got a feathery touch for how big he is. He can take collisions, and he still concentrates and put it, puts it up there so softly. Draymond elbow jumper, and he got it. Curry one more time. Herb Jones was with him, but not close enough. And 285 pounds with that speed and power and bounce. And Curry held off the ball. Two now. Took him some time to have the name grow on him. So now we know two people named Kalena. I've never met anybody else right, I've, with I've that name. Neither have I. Pajemski to the rim. His first NBA bucket. Someone from the Pelicans is beating the Warriors down. See the two men blitzing Steph. That's what Sacramento did in that fourth quarter. Aaron Collins was watching that game. He told us that. Curry down the lane. Moody's got an open look. And bottoms a three. Warriors have done a good amount of that. You're going to need more of it in the second half. Now 16 for Steph in the first quarter. Had the single bucket in the second. Very efficient. But I think Willie Green didn't wait for the second half for his game plan. It was like, all right, Curry's going nuts. <laughs> Two guys are guarding him every time he crosses midcourt. And we should see probably more of that. Curry with Moses Moody. Andrew Wiggins, Looney, and Draymond. Remember, this is a back-to-back -back for Draymond, his first action of the NBA season last night and then tonight. They're trying to expose McCollum down there. That's what you want. Wiggins first bucket of the night. CJ missing there. And Steph Curry with the rebound in motion. Steph, a little stop and go, a little step under, and have the shot blocked. And on top of his game, he wants to work inside. Warriors are willing to give up his three ball. Steph Curry for three, already running back. Steph is privy to the baseline drive, baseline drift. The Steph movement without the ball. You got Looney there, he's working off of him. Looks like they're up to like 17 fast and furious. Well, one of them was Tokyo Drift, and so that's where I was going after that. Yep. Well, Hawkins, a rookie in double figures with 10. Steph Curry rimming out that three. Here. We get a fourth and get Zion out with no Brandon Ingram. Where do the Pelicans find their points? Andrew Wiggins. Hook to start the half. It's much easier if you start close to the basket on a guard that's smaller than you. Zion contesting on Steph on the perimeter. See Herb Jones play that good defense. And Herb Jones will pick up the foul. The other official called that one. Now Herb attack. Jones is going to get a tee. Yeah, because the official that was right next to him. Well, Danica Jason. Mosher didn't blow the whistle. Yeah. Jason Goebbels in the slot there. He did. Yeah, that, that's why they called it late. Because it felt like Herb Jones lunged at Steph enough. He just went straight up. Maybe initially it looked like he leaned in, Steph leaned in, but they're going to give it to Steph. That, that's a foul all day, every that's day. A foul. So there's the technical on Herb Jones. This type of shooting nights, the Warriors become almost invincible. You got to take advantage of it. He's 11 of 16. They get 12 of 17. Another three, and he's got 35. Here he comes. 
Oh, step out of the corner. Oh, he got another one. This should count for more than three points. This is supreme confidence, supreme talent. Look, they just got a little confused there, a little hesitation. Any hesitation, indecision with Steph, he's knocking it down before you can blink. Zion Williamson is supposed to stay with him so the double team can get there, but Steph shook him so bad, made him run away. In his office, in the gym, by himself. Uh, it just comes as second nature out here. This is an exciting road trip for the Dubs. There's Pojemski setting up Peyton. Shot clock at seven. Draymond down the lane, little floater is oh, short. Sure, sure, sure. Out in a three or five point game. You're fighting human nature now. Uh, keep your foot on the gas pedal. Run through the tape, nose first. The lead at 20 right now. I'm gonna ask you about Zion as Steph comes in. Is was guarding a left-handed player? I right think it, you know. I mean, Molly being left-handed, like oh, there's lefties are so skilled. It seems it's so difficult and so unusual because so oh. many guys are right-handed. Williamson. Apart from him going left is just how strong he is. Yeah. Just trying to make sure I hold my ground, my base is strong, my knees are bent. Hopefully I'm able to keep him from attacking, but easier said than done. Steph Curry off iron there. Seen Looney on him. Well, he ate up Memphis in the season opener. Then they beat the Knicks here for their home opener. Pelicans 